Jones got to the final turn, just said, no, nah, I'm not going to run any further. It's had a satisfactory here going at 23.03. Uh, all of its race starts, it's been slow away. We'll see what it does here under the care of Nicole Price. Number four, Power of Jewels, set to go. Away, slow away, back in last placing. Rocket Bash is going to get across and find the lead. Power of Jewels is about four lengths away and starting to stoke up. Chevy Chase is racing out after the leader. Power of Jewels gets into third placing but not making ground quick enough to catch the leader. Then Power Bank behind those Hayride, Row Bottom and Long Gully Nicky. But Rocket Bash is going to be too good. Second Chevy Chaser. Again, Power of Jewels switched off. It's run last. It just didn't want to finish off behind those Long Gully Nicky. Power Bank, I think was fourth in front of Hayride Row Bottom and it gets to the last turn Power of Jewels, that's what it did at Wagga Wagga it just walked over the concluding stage as it was ten lengths away in last placing it's got its few issues very very fast Greyhound when it uh, is switched on but it's just got into the habit of just turning off around that last turn, got into third placing and got to the last bend and said nah, that's it it's pretty well exactly what it did at Wagga Wagga. So...